It's the video that sent shockwaves through Crown Heights. A Jewish man being randomly punched as he passes a group of young people. Police say these are the thugs they're looking for in the attack, which community leaders are now calling a sick game named Knockout. And the premise of the game is primarily a group of cowards that walk together and they see somebody they can prey on and they wind up punching them as hard as they can for the purpose of knocking them out and then to walk away laughing about it. Police say there have been at least eight recent attacks in the Crown Heights area, some on children. Here near Rutland Road, a number of Jewish kids were pelted with rocks as they walked home from school last week. We in the Orthodox Jewish community are facing an epidemic of anti-Semitism right now. As leaders called today for an end to the violence, parents remained on edge. It's horrible. It's disgusting. It's horrible in any neighborhood. It's not a joke. This is about kids getting harmed. Can lose an eye, can lose a foot, can lose a hand. It's unfortunate that we are um, in November 2013, and I have to be concerned about my children walking to school, to and from school, and I have to be concerned about my wife wanting to take a stroll in Eastern Parkway, and she can't do that. While police continue their investigation of the attacks, the hope now is to stop the violence by sending a united message. I want to talk to them about that. Talk to them about the 115th year of the NAACP coming together where blacks and Jews came together 115 years ago to make sure that this city and this nation stood up. Stop it. Stop it now. Knockout will only get you arrested and locked up. Right now, police are trying to determine if there's a pattern and if the same people are responsible for all of the attacks. In Brooklyn, Lori Bordenero, News 4 New York.